So a while ago I recorded a video that I stated as soon as I got my ratcheting screwdriver we would tear open the um, the next part of the whole home networking series the trend net green net uh, switch to find out what's inside. Now I have been told many times that you are not supposed to open it up but I do not care. This is for you guys so we will open it up and find out what's inside. All right, so both screws are out. I should have this on a magnetic part magnetic part tray, but I don't have one of those. So, let's us go ahead and attempt to open it okay so this slides out like so and then you just have what appears to be completely passively cooled okay so you have your power in here your um your ethernet blocks here and then your power led is connected directly to the pcb on the bottom you can't really see much but i'll go ahead and angle that up you can see just the solder points for most of those. I'm not going to um, unscrew this because frankly I am going to be using this for the whole home networking series but I just wanted to make a quick video that basically just went over this whole thing and kind of explained um, what was in here. I mean honestly I was expecting to see a few more capacitors and I don't even see one. That may be one, just a tiny one, but like I was expecting to see a bunch of capacitors, um, a few different uh, components, but for the most part, this also looks partially modular because, sure, there's this uh, little rivet here. Um, however, this board is easily removable, so you could essentially install a um, like a same board that would fit in this block, but one that is managed instead of unmanaged. So this is easily like upgradable to be um, kind of a managed switch, even though that processor and memory, I guess, um, only focuses on being a unmanaged switch. So, I guess this has been the first look inside of the TrendNet GreenNet Gigabit Switch. The uh, model number is TEG-S50G. So, if you want to see more teardowns like this, um, I don't really know what to tear down. Um, I may actually tear down uh, Rusty Red and upgrade his hard drive in there. But that may take a while to do, so I'm not even worried about that. So if you guys want to see more, be sure to give a huge like on this video. And yeah. So I do want to give a huge shout out to everyone who joined me in my last stream. Uh, thank you guys so much. Um, that was awesome. Also... If you like the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. That helps us out a lot. Also, if you can, subscribe for more, like, for more videos like this one. Also, click up here for uh, different support options that we offer, as well as to uh, have access to the URL to change your Amazon and eBay and all those bookmarks, because that's awesome and that helps us out a ton. Um, if you're looking to find something else to watch, click up here and watch the last stream that I made and uploaded and my finger is being blanked out because of the light. Anyway, so I do want to thank you all again for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye! Yeah.